we're being asked to solve this equation, so solution. The trick is to think of the equation as follows. This is really e to the x squared minus 6 e to the x plus 8 equals 0, right? Because e to the x squared is just e to the 2 times x, properties of exponents. Another way to think about it is e to the x squared is really e to the x times e to the x. And when you have common bases and you're multiplying, you add the exponents. So x plus x, so you get 2x. So a couple different ways to think about it. Now we'll factor. This will be e to the x, parentheses, parentheses, e to the x equals 0. We need two numbers that multiply to 8 but add to negative 6. I'm thinking, yep, negative 4 and negative 2. If you multiply negative 4 times negative 2, you get positive 8. And if you add negative 4 and negative 2, you get negative 6. So that checks. You have a product, and it's equal to 0. So now you can set each factor equal to 0. equals 0. Solve for the e to the x. So e to the x is 4. And take the natural log of both sides. And then this is just x equals ln 4. That's one answer. Do the same thing over here. e to the x is equal to 2. Take the natural log of both sides. You can skip a lot of this work. I'm just showing some extra steps. This is x, and here you get the natural log of 2.